This is our first uh, asparagus bed. We have two asparagus beds. This is now in its uh, third or fourth year. And uh, what I'm going to do now, because chickens are now here free ranging, and uh, they may come and here dig it when it is dry in the dry weather and expose the roots of the asparagus. So I'm going to put some uh, bars here and put this uh, netting around them and uh, hoping that that will stop the chickens from bothering it. So this is the time. I will do it in May I think they will come to through uh, the first shoots, this first spears up here. So it's almost the time now. I will do it now. I have now put the four metal bars on the four corners of this raised bed and uh, now I'm going to put this plastic um, I've done it with one side the top part of it just goes on the hook the lower part is uh, with a, uh, some string lower part again I will not do the complete down there because I want to move it and harvest the uh, asparagus spears when they're coming so I'm going to repeat this for that side that side is not tied yet and those and okay. this side. the asparagus bed now is ready for growth of the asparagus I have, think I have here about 20 or 25 asparagus crowns and if they give each at least one I will have 25 crowns and uh, yeah, 10 crown for a meal and uh, yeah, I will have probably for two, three meals this year from this bed, at least. And I've added manure in the last year, so, and I will keep an, an eye on the weeds if they grow here. Of course, the chickens are here, they don't let anything grow. <laughs> Since I have the chickens here, no wheat growing, only a few nettles, which they don't like really, but the rest of the things are all right. So, asparagus bed, first one, ready. Here we go, May time. And chickens, you can see, they're hanging around it, but they kind of way inside, they kind of find a way inside. It's practically working.